Hey everybody, welcome back to Conscientious Omnivore. My name is Pal. I'm a very sweaty and tired Conscientious Omnivore today. I've been out here since uh, 7 this morning working with my dad, um, working on building the house. But uh, just a little bit of gardening here, um, mostly watering really, and just uh, a tiny little harvest. I uh, just wanted to show you guys really quick. A bunch of the tomatoes are starting to kind of ripen now. Especially the little ones seem to be doing really good. Um, but uh, also some of the chili peppers are starting to uh, ripen. Like that guy over there, that little black one near the flower. I'll show you guys close up in a little bit. Here's the harvest as it stands for today. A bunch of uh, tomatoes, really excited about these. Uh, these are the first uh, of this type that I'm um, harvesting. I love this kind, I don't even know the name of it. It might be the black crim, but I'm not even sure. I'm terrible with these uh, varieties and stuff. Maybe some of you guys watching will probably just know by looking at it, but they're really tasty. Kind of like greenish uh, tinted um, tomatoes on the inside a little bit. Uh, super good. Got one um, longhorn chili. Uh, the end started kind of going bad, so I'm going to just uh, take that one down. I don't know what color it's supposed to be when it's fully done, but uh, yeah, anyway, there's a bunch. So I just chopped that one off. Curious what it tastes like. Give that a shot. Um, flowers are doing great. Uh, some of the corn is actually starting to grow, so we'll end up with a couple of little uh, ears of corn, so that's pretty cool. Um, let me zoom in quick for you guys on some of the chilies, because some of them are pretty amazing. Let's go check those out. Alright, so don't even know all the varieties here, but uh, here's some of them that are really nice. Um, don't know what these are. These I think are called a mountain longhorn chili or something like that if I remember right. Uh, the only reason I even vaguely remember the name is because um, they have such a distinctive shape and my brother mentioned it's something longhorn but just look at how many there are in there it's like insane chili city it's really cool. Um, then we got uh, some more over here don't know what these are either but uh, they look pretty pretty serious I'm sure they're spicy as heck got a bunch on here got uh, something here that kind of resembles like maybe a jalapeno although I'm not sure um, that I know is a jalapeno because I remember my brother told me when he was here one day visiting it's a farmer's jalapeno I believe so there's a couple of nice ones on there um, these are really cool these are the little black ones um, pretty soon I think these can be harvested I don't think these get too big if I remember right I don't even remember what these are called. I don't know if this is the Black Hungarian or if this is some kind of scorpion thing. I don't know, but whatever. There's just so many. It's so cool. There's a bunch of little guys on that one down in there. Yeah, so there's just so many and there's so many tomatoes. It's really cool. I got to stake more stuff out. I just have been so busy. I haven't had a chance. There's like a gajillion, um, uh, what do you call it? Uh, peppers and tomatoes down in there as well. There's more in this. This thing is like a tree. I gotta get in here and show you guys this one. Look at this thing. Just look at this. This is so cool. It's got just tons and tons of chilies growing on this thing and the, the trunk of it is just massive. Like, let me try to get in close. Look at that thing. <laughs> it's like as thick as my, thing, my finger. It's massive, so cool. I'm really impressed with the growth of this one. There's just so many peppers in there as well. And then some of the tomatoes are kind of falling all over here. I should really stake things out. But uh, really excited. Um, Got to get in here. I need I need some time. Lots of tomatoes ripening in here as well. So yeah, just uh, it's going good. I'm pretty happy. With how little time I'm actually able to uh, dedicate to this, I think it's actually going pretty good. I'm getting really bad glare here, so I can't really see my screen. Hopefully you guys can see the other area here. And uh, yeah, actually you can see uh, the extension that my dad and I have been working on. Right now it's just covered because we're supposed to get rain tomorrow. But uh, yeah man, peppers um, galore, more tomatoes, sage is growing really nicely. The uh, loofah squash is going pretty good in there. I'll try to get in there. That's that one. Kind of started meandering over there. 
That's one of the sage plants. That one's doing really good. So is that one over there. And this is the ajipanka over here. So that's pretty cool. Um, there is some fruit on it finally developing right down here. So I'm very excited about that. There's another one back in there, in there. Really looking forward to that. It's one of my all time favorite uh, peppers. It's really, really cool. The uh, Fissilis is doing great. Finally starting to get some fruit on those. I'm gonna do a video of that eventually. Just, uh, I think I'll let it go full cycle. So I'll do from seed to uh, fruit and then, uh, you know, chop up the video at that point and show you guys. Got a little bit of cilantro down here. Um, it's gone to seed. So I just need to collect that because uh, they're already getting dried out. This one's fully dry, I should just collect it. Haven't had a chance to do that yet. Really wanted to do a lot more, but I just got a couple tiny little ones that got planted out late. And uh, it looks to be another either cucumber or squash down here. And um, got some eggplants, but they're really tiny still. So I don't, I don't know if these are gonna do anything before the end of the summer, but we'll see. So yeah. Pretty excited. There's a couple of little peppers down at the end of this as well. So it's pretty cool. So uh, yeah, that's it for today. Just wanted to give you guys a quick update. Work is progressing on the house. Um, it's been a ton of work. I'm super tired. We've been starting really early, um, doing long days. So uh, yeah, so far so good. I'll let you guys know how things are going. All right, see you in the next one. Bye.